traffic right now. It's absolutely insane. So the rickshaws and cars and bicycles and motorbikes and cows and then what's even scarier is it's real, like this is not fake. Like this is the streets. Just, just chaos, it's, it's fun days. Today I'm gonna to talk about my four year trip around the world. But what I want you to understand is the distance between who you are and what you wanna become is shorter than you think. With a backpack, a virgin passport, and a one-way ticket to China, I left. I'd never traveled outside the country in my entire life. Andy's talk is not just about travel, I think it's really important because it inspires undergraduates in a time that they're transitioning at a major point of their life. He does a great job of making you feel like you're capable of anything. I've definitely had struggles in the past in trying to decide what I want to do with my life and you know I need to know right now. But then after listening to Andy's story, it's that life is not linear, that life throws so many different turns and curves in the road and you just have to take risks and I think that really, that really resonated with me. I've had students in the past that ask me when he's coming to speak again because they want to come back and hear him again and I'm the same way, I've came back three times but I got something new every time. Some wonderful people come into our room from Tony Shea to Ashton Kutcher has spoken to my students. But what I can tell you in all honesty is that when uh, all is said and done, Andy's is the name that they remember. His is the story that they care about. The goal was naively simple, to go see how people live in the world. To go experience life. I wanted to understand how the locals lived. So among other things, I lived in a Buddhist temple in Korea, played an 18th century British soldier in a Bollywood movie, worked in a dress factory in Bangkok, Worked on a 450,000 anchor cattle ranch in Australia. Over here, go! I ended up living in a mud hut in Zambia with a guy who taught me how to farm maize. His story is just, it's, it's so cool. So, I mean, amazing. He went to so many different countries and so many different places and got to meet so many people. My students, what they really want is they want to be inspired. And truly, that's what Andy's all about. The lesson is, if you want to make a change in your life, like if you want something to happen, you have to put yourself out there. It's so inspirational. I mean, I don't know, just everything about it. You can just sit back and relax, and it's like he takes you on this wonderful journey. The American dream will always be there for you, but your own dreams, if you listen, are much, much bigger.